Hey guys, it's Brie. So today I'm going to be doing a review on my County Cloth Creations pad. I don't know why it's taken me so long to do a review on this pad because I've had this pad for ages. I think I've had this for almost the whole time I've been using cloth pads. So over just under a year and a half maybe. And I use it a lot. So I'm really surprised I haven't done a review on it yet. But basically I love this pad. It just, it's one of those pads that contours your body really well. But first of all, I'm going to go over what it's made of. So it's cotton topped and it's a dark navy, which is great because now I'm trying to like avoid light prints. There are some white owls, but I tend to bleed right here, so I don't stain it very easily at all. Uh, it's cotton topped and it's micro fleece backed. This can be a worry for some people having micro fleece on the back because micro fleece is not water resistant, but I've never ever had a leak on this pad and it's so, so thin. I mean, like, hang on, let me fold this in half. I don't get why people do this, but, you know, you can see here. This is a moderate flow pad, and you can just see, like, it's it's ridiculously thin. And I've never leaked with it, so I've never had an issue with it. Um, the core is, and I'm not entirely sure whether she's changed it since I got this one, because with cloth pad makers, they're work-at-home mums, so they, well, not even, not necessarily work-at-home mums, but they're work-at-home makers, so they, they often change things about their pads quite quickly. Um, I do know that she now uses flannel for the core, and this could very well be flannel. It does feel, it feels like it's either bamboo fleece or flannel. Some kind of fleece or flannel, it's not absorb or anything like that. But uh, for, a regular, for a moderate flow pad now, she uses four layers of flannel. And, you know, flannel is one of those fabrics that will constantly surprise you with how absorbent it is. It really does absorb a lot more than you think, and often people start making pads with flannel, and then realise they don't need to put as many layers in because it absorbs so much. Um, when I was making pads, I always had people commenting on how absorbent my panty liners were, and they only had one layer of flannel in them. But onto the pad, it, you can tell its absorbency by the purple snap on the back. She uses a purple heart snap now. These ones are actually both purple on the back and white on the front, but I am confident that this is a moderate flow pad, because that's what I said on the giveaway blog that I won this from. Uh, it was ages ago, and I mean, it was I won it by default, because the person who actually won it didn't come and claim it and the, the owner of the blog actually, I had bought some pads of her, she said she'd throw this in with me, so I didn't pay for this pad, but at the same time, it wasn't sent directly for a review, I've just decided to review it, but I love it, because when you snap it up, it's only got one snap, but I think that's good, because I don't like pads that have two snaps, snaps now, because I find that they just, it pulls in the middle here, you can see, it just makes it do this weird shape thing. So one snap, and then you can see here, it's just really, really flexible, and it contours so well to my body. So when I'm wearing this pad, I don't, I can, I can easily forget I'm wearing it. I just don't think of it at all. So I really, really do love it. I tend to wear it this way around, upside down, just because I feel like this part is slightly shorter than this part, and I need more coverage at the back. But that doesn't really bother me because you know it, they're, they're handmade, so they're not going to be perfect. But I, re but you know, the stitching is really good. Having said that, the stitching is really good. And I've never had a problem with it, I've had it for over a year, there's no signs of wear or tear on it, so I really, really, really would recommend these pads, especially if you like thin pads and pads that contour to your body really easily. So that is my cat, and I've been meaning to buy another pad from her, I want to get some panty liners, I'm just not as keen on buying pads overseas anymore as I used to be, uh, but hopefully I'm going to get an Etsy voucher for Christmas and then I will definitely consider getting some more of these because I really, really do love them. So thanks for watching guys, please subscribe, don't forget to check out the links below and I will talk to you later. Bye bye.